I'm Shauna Byrne, and he's Josh Byler. I'm going to show you what it takes to get out alive to some of the most dangerous places on Earth. I've got to make it through a week of challenges in the sort of places you wouldn't last a day without the right survival skills. This is Man's vs. Wild Cobras. Interesting. It seems to have words. Words. Oh, okay. And and people on. Yes. On Wait. Boards. Okay. To survive, there's three things we need: food, water, and shelter. So we need to go find that. Okay, that's good. We've made our shelter. Now we need to take cover. Give him the shelter. Give him the shelter. In case any torrential rainstorms come. So this is how you would make a standard shelter in the wild. We are safely in our shelter. Nothing can disturb us. But next, we still need to find food and water to s survive. Food is necessary for us to keep moving and get out of this wild place, which we had no clue where we are. All right, let's go. Oh. <sighs> oh, I need to see if there's any water around here or food. We just need to find something to sustain us. Look, over there! Water! Oh, water. Give the water! 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 Give me some water! Oh. Yeah. That's some good water. Now we need to find food. Okay, we'll look for some entertainment in these books. We need to find some food. The food can be anywhere in this hostile environment. Even inside books. Just look everywhere. Look! Food! 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 It's nature! 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 nature. Okay, we found some rope. We're gonna now go out for the hunt. Hunting. We're going hunting for the morning. A good way to hunt is with this rope. Standard rope. Oh, food! Look! Food. Look. It's, it's food! Food! Ah. 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 Oh. 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 
Time up. Time up. Time up. The hand is my homework. Time. What is he talking about? Oh. Homework. Oh. homework. Oh. It's not even me. Oh. And we have dinner oh. for the night. Dinner, dinner, dinner. Chicken dinner. Oh. Oh. Just drag oh. it. <laughs> okay. Now that we've had our food, we need to find fire or make fire so we can cook it. My homework needs to be handed in. A lot of survival backpacks and stuff have these. They look like useless tops. But they're very compact and good. And they, and they, and they, they keep you warm. Very, very warm. They're like toasty. It's like your, your toast is in an oven. And then if you ever need a resource of this is your last option. You can eat these little um, food sticks. Food sticks. Well, nutritious. No, we still have that bar of oh, food. Oh, oh, oh. Ah. have to move on and try to find civilization soon. Yes, we tried to find food, but it just didn't work. So if you try to find food, but you just can't get food. You have to move on. You have to move on. So we will move. We don't know what this entails. We do There seems to be some type of... Oasis. Oh, I don't know. But we have to find out. Let's move. It looks like we have found another habitat. But it's already dark. We're going to need to make shelter soon. Okay, we've made our shelter. It seems to be substantial for the night. Just for the night. Right. Now we need to get our sleep. A sleep is very key, so you can travel long distances and find civilization. But I'm very hungry. We're gonna need to find some food. Protein is key to diet. Yes. Which is why we're gonna have to catch a meal today, not just find some. Look, look! Like I'm I see you behind. We gotta get away from these humans. There seems to be people here. I don't know what they're doing, but they seem to be paying attention to, to, uh, to, to uh, an older person. What? What are, they, what are they learning about? I don't know. It seems to be some kind of a study of the world. Mm. The rise of factories and railroads. Sounds interesting. Do you think we could use this for firewood? Oh, yeah, definitely. Good. It may cause fire. We need to focus the sun on the book. We need to. Very focused. I can't get it right. The sun seems to be in a good position today. It's caught on fire! Perfect. We need to get our food. We're going to need to eat her soon. She. Whoa! Her hand! <laughs> That's not normal. Get back in there. She must have a weird type of meat. We need to get rid of it. I think, I think, I think it's bad meat. It's bad meat. We gotta get that out of here. We must dispose of it.
ancient remedy I learned from my grandmother. You just take a snake and rub it all over their faces until it's well smothered with snake gut. It's, it's, he seems to be better now. We must move on. Yes, we are going to get out of here. We seem to be in a new habitat. This place seems to have numbers around. This seems to be one of the teaching people. Interesting in the wild, in its natural habitat. Needs quite a liquid. I just found some. Now that we're in our shelter, we need to find some protection from the sun, because it's very, very bright in here. So we need to find something to do that with. Let's go. But as I'm looking, I see children coming in. Maybe they want to learn too, like the others. Let's go. We need to find some paper. Paper to we can protect our heads. Many things. That's protection. From the rain, the heat, the cold, the whatever. We got to go. Now we have our paint. Now we have this to make our stuff. Let's go. Yeah. Right, we just climbed out of this window, out of our shelter. So now we're free. We're free to run. It seems, it seems they're leaving too. Look at them. Bus. Let's get out of here. All right, we need to find some water or liquid. And while we're at it, point out the interesting, um, this is Miss Kula. She lives in the wild with the she's, man group. I think she's one of those teaching people. She has a What are you doing? No, It's not even on there. You can't even see. No. Oh, oops. <laughs> Do I like fake scream like? Ah. <laughs> and, like everyone looks behind and I'm gone. But Josie goes. I'm <laughs> Josie. <laughs> yes. All right. Yeah. <laughs> 